Hello everybody, Kanisha the Creator here. I am here today to give you my review of High School Musical, the musical, the series, season 4, episode 4. Ain't it crazy? You better say yes because this, because this episode is wild. Ooh, Halloween. Never thought it would be an episode for drama, but boy was the drama coming. Maddox was playing this little prank. Spooked everyone. Made me laugh. Seems Gina and Ricky are both trying to confront each other about a little thing. Obviously Gina about the whole fake relationship thing to boost the production of High School Musical 4. And Ricky to tell Gina about Danny playing Gabriella. And let's just say and let's just say both went out in flames and Ricky called Ricky ran off from the party and told Gina that he needs some time. Miss Jen and well Ricky's dad broke up. Seth finally confronted Carlos but it wasn't about the whole Hit, uh, about the documentary thing. Apparently, oh, this hurts my soul. Uh, apparently, Seb cheated on Carlos during the summer. Obviously, I know it didn't mean anything, but it still broke me. I was like, I, when I heard that, I was shocked. Boy, I still am in shock. I just finished the episode. <laughs> Sheesh. I was like, Sap. I don't believe what I'm hearing. <laughs> no way. I just was hoping. I just was hoping he was just being blind about the whole documentary thing, and he just believed it just because it was on television. But to actually have cheated on Carlos. I cannot believe it! And there was this random guy, I think his name was Jerry, wearing a pumpkin costume, gave Carlos a piece of candy, was sitting there the whole time during the party, completely silent, and apparently has a crush on Carlos and tried to confront him right after the moment when Seb was trying to apologize for che cheating on Carlos. What the heck is going on in this episode? Sorry. <laughs> a lot happened. Woo! Maddox and Ashley were singing a song. Oh, and I forgot to say during the scare, Ashley? Yeah. Almost said, uh, well, gave uh, Maddox mouth to mouth retipitation because she thought that she had gotten fried and. You know, she had passed out, but it was all just a joke. It was a prank. <laughs> yeah. And to everybody, it's very obvious that Jet still has a thing for Courtney. Even though he tried to say that he's over it. <laughs> yeah, right. Everything is crazy right now. It's all gone into flames. They filed? Finally, Ricky and Gina came out as a couple to everybody, but not Gina's mom, unfortunately, which was what made Ricky walk away from the party. It is crazy, all this stuff that's happened. At least we got a good moment with Miss Jen and Ricky and about the whole, you know, Ricky being overwhelmed by everything that has happened. And he needs help with the letter of recommendation because he's finally starting to think about college. The question still remains, what college will he choose? Is Ashley and Big Red going to be okay? How the heck does Maddox feel at the fact that she almost kissed Ashlyn when she knows Ashlyn has a boyfriend? What is going to happen next episode? Boy, there is a lot going on. Man, I am overwhelmed. This is way too much. This is too much for me. I, I, I don't know if I can handle this. This is just too much. This is too much for me. Woo, I am overwhelmed. Let me see if there's anything I forgot. Well, see, I had to take notes because a lot happened in this episode. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. 
nope, nope, nope. I pretty much covered everything. Yeah, it was crazy. Oh, let me tell you, my favorite song. Don't get me wrong, I like the Ashlyn and Maddox song. That was interesting. But no, no, no. My favorite song was when all of them were singing about their fears and there was a freaking zombie thing. Oh my gosh, did I love that. That was so much That was so much freaking fun. Like, they were all... Like, it was all crazy. I loved them. This is so... I love the characters that were zombies. That was crazy. I loved it so much. That song. I put it out on my playlist. I swear I put it out on my playlist. I loved it. It was really good. Woo. I'm still going to give it a 7 out of 10. But boy, was the drama a lot. Boy, was the drama a lot. Ooh, and I love that for the intro this time they used the spooky theme. I love spooky themes. It's kind of my thing. <laughs> I love watching horror movies. Even though I do seem like the type that's scary easily, I do like horror movies. Anyway, yeah. Yeah, that's how I feel about this episode. Woo, was it crazy. I don't know how I'm going to feel about the next episode. Stay tuned and find out. Bye.